Thanks for staying with us. We may never need our credit cards to buy groceries or gas. Some are calling it the wave of the future. It's a new cafe cash register inside the Peak Sports Club on Perryville, allowing us to use our palms for payment. Whitney? Yeah, Mike, when I first asked the owner about the device, I thought he was kidding when he said I could buy a bottle of water with my hand. My reaction is one that a lot of customers have, as many Peak Gym members are leaving their credit cards at home. I never thought that we'd be able to do something with that just with our hand. Nick Liston works out at Peak Sports Club almost every day. And while these weights get his blood pumping, his blood vessels. Just place your wrists here. Will help pay for his post gym snack. Just be able to walk up, pay with my hand. It's it's really convenient. It's the first cash register of its kind in the Midwest, and it's right here in Rockford. And just gently lay your fingers over inside the Thrive Cafe at the gym's Perryville location. Owner Jason Rager says once we sign up, the pattern of our blood vessels will be linked to our credit card. Yeah, you don't need your phone, you don't need your keys, you don't need a scan card, all you need is your hand. All right, just hit OK, do you need a receipt? No, I don't. It's called biotechnology. The device scans the movement in our hands by setting them here. So essentially, we're paying with our own identification. It's kind of crazy, definitely outside the box. <laughs> But it's convenient. Where did this idea come from? The How company's come creator out of New York says the device could change the future of retail. I think biometrics is the way forward. I think uh, biometrics is something that's still growing as a technology. Um, but at the end of the day, I really don't see physical like currency uh, and credit cards being, being the future. I think it'll be something else. Bio says the technology is safer than just using our credit cards. In terms of security, um, you know, we don't store, Bio does not store any financial data in our own server. The card processing company tokenizes the credit cards and uh, we just store kind of a reference token. So basically how it works is... Saying customers like Listit are in safe hands. At first I was really skeptical. I didn't really think that it would work, but seeing it in action, it's pretty cool. And I do want to be clear, this is not a chip in our hands. A short 30-second preview of tonight's story went viral, shared more than 9,000 times. Many concerned about where technology is headed again. The device reads the pattern of our blood vessels, so nothing is implanted. Okay, so now we know nothing's implanted. Yes, but is, very this, important. is this still secure? That's the concern. The company says it's secure. Jason, of course, with Thrive yeah. Cafe, says that it's secure as well because it's not like fingerprints. We're not leaving them as we go. It's our blood vessels. So essentially, if we cut our arms off, it, it wouldn't work still. It goes by the pattern, the way that our blood is moving. And we want to let you know, too, there are a lot of questions when it comes to this. We could talk about this yeah. for a long time. There's a Q&A, frequently asked questions. We put them on our website, our web channel at WIFR.com. And if you have more questions that maybe aren't answered there, you can email um, the, the bio group. So I'll let you know. So can I say, Whitney, I ran out of money. Can I borrow your hand? Yeah, it wouldn't work. That's no? the thing. Okay. And if you really, if you're going to go to that extreme, just take the Gatorade, take the water. Nobody wants that. So. All right, sounds good. Well, we'll